Is my head okay? Yeah, I'm you're just... good. No, you're good. Okay, I think okay I'm always worried about my headspace. Or he would have told you. That's true. That's true. <laughs> Come on, Andrea, please. I think he would have just went, oh no, I'll just let her be. Because I also do this. I'm like, me. Hey. Yeah. I had to do an audition for a commercial that I had to do that. Playing somebody didn't know how to use, like, <laughs> do all these things with my head. She's got like maybe even longer than a 50 year career in theater. Bradford, Shaw, Can Stage, Soul Pepper, Tarragona, and that's just Toronto. Big blockbusters as well. My big fat Greek wedding. Parts one and, and two. two. And she was in Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again. Tommy Boy, Degrassi, Slings and Arrows. And Schitt's Creek, Tactical Girls. And save me, ladies and gentlemen. She Maria goes. Vakraxis. Oh. Yay! Oh. <laughs> How did you get into being Becoming an actor. In grade 13, I was going to go to law school and I got a thing from my English teacher and said they're auditioning for the theater school at University of Windsor. And I went, okay. She helped me and I got in. And then I kept thinking, oh, I'll just be a teacher. But then I graduated. My friends were moving to Toronto and I went, well, I'll just go and do that. And I'll give myself five years. And it was my mistake. <laughs> What was your first gig here in Toronto? The artistic director of the Red Light Theater Company, which was the feminist theater company in the 70s in Toronto. And she said, I just got your resume. Why don't you read for this play? But I got paid, I think, $25 a week. Director from New York, and she was insane. And actors were drawn <laughs> out. And then we opened, and I don't know, there were snowstorms. I think we had four performances, and the theater closed. I'm going to just share something. I'll have chicken wings. Kitchen's closed until dinner. Just got cold stuff and dessert. Boy, some chicken wings had really hit the spot. You sure it's closed? Let me check. Yep, it's closed. <laughs> That was their first film. First day, they had never learned lines, anything, because they were improv guys. I think we shot that for 14 hours or something. Uh, Sheila, can you come here for a second? What can I do for you, ladies? Say you knew a teenager and he was always in the red. Would food have anything to do with it? Food? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be kidding. At your age, it's all about hormones. Oh my God, I've never seen that. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. So you gave sex tips to Drake. Rihanna really owes me, I guess. <laughs> One day I went, oh my God, I think I, well, that's the same guy. That's oh. Drake. And now he's a cajillionaire. Here's another one. If this is some kind of sick prank by one of you vaginas, <laughs> I swear, I will not only disembowel you, I will fire you without severance and report you to the police. <laughs> you keep showing me being a bitch. Was I ever nice in anything? <laughs> that was Tactical and Girls, by the way. Working with those women and Matt Companion, it was just hilarious. And when young women are doing something in this business, you know what? I I'm in. Never regret that. <laughs> anything that you got coming up? In the summer, I did the Kids in the Hall. I'd worked with them back in the day. I just immediately said yes. I hadn't seen those guys in forever. Yeah. And I had a blast. That's coming on in Amazon. Super and I didn't play a bit. <laughs> Maria, thank you so much. That was a surprise. I didn't know what was going to happen. This was great. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Cool. She's so cool. It's women creating yeah. something. She goes, I'll help. I'll do anything. And she's just so freaking talented. Yeah. Hey, share. Not Canadian. Okay. No. Although she's, she's done stuff in Canada. No. Sorry. Not I mean, Canadian. share, comment, like. Oh. <laughs> But Cher would be nice to have on. <laughs>